Hello my friends, I'm back again with Dev Diary by Danushka. So this time I thought of doing a tutorial uh, which is an extended version of my earlier tutorial which was uh, configuring Vue.js with Material UI. So this time I'm going to add some icons, uh, actually material icons to my configured project. Now I have up and running application as you can see in the right side panel I have uh, configured view with material elements, cards, buttons and input elements. So now I'm going to add some icons to my UI. But before that you need to add icon font like this. Here uh, you can uh, find it from the Google APIs here like that in this URL. I will post this one in the uh, comment section as well. And after that you need to go to the view component and uh, let me add another div element like this uh, just to make it easy to read and you need to add MD icon here like that this is the element you are going to use when you are working with icons so inside this MD icon you need to specify what is the icon you are going to be used like that see now uh, my check icon is uh, rendered on the UI properly uh, which is extracted from material icons. So all the material icons can be found here in the material IO resources tab. You can find, the, uh, find all the icons available. You can uh, use these things for any purpose actually uh, when I am searching for icons if I am working with material UI all the time I find my icons here without any problem actually. Uh, there are very limited number of cases uh, if I am working in material UI and I want another icon and I'm going for font or some kind of thing because uh, material has a rich set of icons here uh, like this uh, if I am going to change this one into some other one uh, like uh, here we can see class like this now you can see it is rendered on the UI so only thing you have to specify is the name of the icon here code chrome reader card travel like those things are the only thing you need to specify inside this md icon element after that icon will be re-rendered on the ui without any problem in addition to that this has another feature of uh, having different sizes of icons for this one you need to add classes md size is the uh, class prefix and if I am adding 2x here the icon size is increased like that and uh, if I am changing it to 4x you can see uh, large icon here like that so you you can use those things based on your preference actually if you need smaller icons or large icons everything is available and the different types of icons are available like that so uh, and uh, this is the uh, thing I wanted to share with you but uh, before end this one I wanted to show one another thing uh, think I have removed this one then you only can see it like that the text part uh, with different sizes here so if you ever encountered something like that uh, first thing you need to check is your uh, font uh, web font link is uh, available or not Otherwise, uh, icons will be rendered on the UI properly without any issues. So this is the tutorial I wanted to share with you this time. And uh, thank you for watching and stay tuned with me. And I will be posting some other more interesting daily stuff later. And uh, see you soon. Bye for now.